I grew up in a Christian church and in a Christian school, and I was pretty much told that that's what I was going to be doing for my family. They went to that church forever. They met in that church, I think, and it wasn't really something that I understood. It was just something I did because I had to, or because it's what I always did. I never, I never really thought about what it meant to be a Christian and to walk with God. I just went through the motions because that's what everyone else around me was doing. When I was given the option as a young adult to continue to go to church, to, to continue to go to that school, I chose not to because I wanted, um, I wanted different, I wanted normal per se. And I went to a public school and I didn't go back to church until I was married. My understanding of being a Christian was to try my hardest to be a good person and to be nice and, and you know try to represent Christianity. We searched for churches for years and we finally found Northridge, which was right down the road from us. And we met great people. We got into a community group that we made good friends and people that um, meant more to us than a lot of people. There was a sermon in October where Drew talked about letting go of your pride and trusting in God and stepping outside of your comfort zone. That was a, pivot, a pivotal moment for me because I realized that I didn't really trust in anybody with my own life. And, and I, I feel like it's a lot of pressure and it's a, lot, it's a lot of weight on my shoulders to control everything. To be a Christian is to give up my understanding of what I think I'm supposed to do and give my trust to God. I want nothing more than to meet God someday and tell Him thank you for making me the best that I could be.